Hi, my name is Eugenia and I'm a math tutor. Today we're going to learn how to use the chain rule in a derivative equation. We use the chain rule when we want to take the derivative of two functions, one inside the other. The proper way to write the chain rule is the derivative of y with respect to x is equal to the derivative of y with respect to u times the derivative of u with respect to x. Now it's a lot easier to think of this informally. What this means is that the derivative of the whole thing is equal to the derivative of the outside function times the derivative of the inside function. So let's say we have one function inside another one, like 4 times 5x squared minus 2 all cubed. The inside function here is 5x squared minus 2, it's in the parentheses. And the outside function is just 4 times something else, the inside function, cubed. So let's try to find the derivative of this. Remember, all we're doing is we're going to take the derivative of the outside function and multiply it by the derivative of the inside function. We said that the outside function is 4 times the inside cubed, so we're going to take the derivative of that first. 4 times the inside function cubed. And we're not going to worry about what the inside function actually is, because for this derivative, we're only concerned with the outside function. Next, we multiply that by the derivative of the inside function, which is 5x squared minus 2. So now we can go ahead and figure out what these derivatives are. For the first part, we're still not concerned with what the inside is. So when we take the derivative of 4 times something cubed, we go ahead and bring down the 3 and get 4 times 3 is 12 times the inside and then the 3 becomes a 2. For this derivative, we have 5x squared first, so we can go ahead and bring the 2 down and that becomes 10x, and the negative 2 disappears. It's starting to look a little better now. Our next step is to simplify. Since we're done taking the derivatives here, we can go ahead and fill in the inside with what it originally was, 5x squared minus 2. So that will give us 12 5x squared minus 2 times 10x. We can go ahead and multiply this 10x into the 12 and we'll get 120x 5x squared minus 2. We can expand this and multiply it out or we can just leave this as our answer. And that's how we use the chain rule to find the derivative of a function. My name is Eugenia and thanks for watching.